Let's talk about aesthetics. You want to be ripped, you want to be buff, you want to be sexy. There's nothing wrong with wanting to improve your physique and looking more youthful and vibrant. But I've got a warning sticker. Don't attach your self-worth to it because what you're really doing is attaching your self-worth to other people's perceptions of you. You're giving up your power and handing it over to other people when you're driven by external validation. Here's what I can get behind and what I'd encourage you to do. Focus on the behaviors, decision-making, habits, and discipline it takes to improve your physique. Attach your self-worth to the character-building elements that ultimately lead to improving your physique as a side effect. Derive your personal value from improving behavior, mindsets, and the decisions you make throughout the day, day after day. That's the source of your power. When you have a good day, great. That's a victory. Now stack another one on top of it. Then stack another one on top of it. Keep stacking days and appreciating those personal victories and the inevitable side effects are that one, you're going to feel empowered. Self-confidence is going to soar and you're going to experience how it carries over to other things, to your business and relationships. Number two, you're going to inspire other people, spreading the vibe, not the virus, because when you feel good about yourself and your decision making, you're filling your own cup and your cup is going to run it over and your positivity and stoke is going to start inspiring other people around you. When you're stoked on yourself, when you're happy about how you're living, you're a better person to other people without even having to think about it. You're a better father, mother, partner, friend, coach, leader, employee. And guaranteed that vibe is going to come back to you in spades like a boomerang. And then number three, your physique is going to improve. Also guaranteed. It's a natural fact that when you stack days of better decisions and behaviors and then sprinkle in some good feelings and positivity about how you're handling business, that your body is going to start rocking as an inevitable side effect of your new hustle. It's going to happen because it's got to happen. And you're going to love it because it came to life from within you and you made it happen. Don't overcook your meat or your mental. Much love. Peace.